I brought us out into the uh, the countryside where it's uh, let's just say it's foggy and misty, and that that kind of represents what life is life like at the moment for us, isn't it? We don't know what the future holds for us, and we're so many of us shut inside again and struggling with that. So we pray in the midst of the fog and the mists of life we may know your love, your light and your peace. In our world, let's just reflect upon our world, all that's happened in America, the pandemic spreading across nations and that hides many other things that are going on throughout our world, concern about the uh, um, the ecology of our planet and so many concerns and the fog and the mists of life we pray for your love your light and your peace we think about our country and those that are working so hard for our good at this time many stretched um I think of our own uh, Sarah Crane, they're working in, uh, 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 and uh, Amanda Pink working in um, Milton Keynes Hospital um, for government as they seek the best way to navigate through all this. Think of the effect on the economy, on children in schools, so, so many aspects of things to consider. In the fog and the mists of life, we pray for your love, your light, and your peace. And what's what's your local community like at the moment? Um, I haven't seen much of people, to be honest, but we pray for our local communities as they seek to uh, handle this situation. For those that are stuck in their homes and really struggling with their mental health, for those that are lonely and isolated, um, for those that are caring for them, for our local communities. In the fog and the mists of life right now, we pray for your love, your light and your peace. And for ourselves, those that we love, it might be that we've, we've lost folk in recent months. It might be that we are struggling with our mental health. It might be that uh, we know of loved ones who right now need your love and care, Lord. It might be people in this church community that we're really concerned about that are struggling to sort of um, connect and to feel anything in life is worth living for. So, Lord, in the fog and the mist, mists of life, we pray, even for ourselves, for your love, your light, and your peace. We pray together. Our Father, who art in heaven, hallowed be your name. Your kingdom come, your will be done on earth as it is in heaven. Give us this day our daily bread and forgive us our trespasses as we forgive those who trespass against us. And lead us not into temptation, but deliver us from evil. For thine is the kingdom, the power and the glory forever and ever.